Hello everyone. Press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. You can contact me on my email address or my email or my phone number. Uh, you don't need to show your farm to an astrologer. Present is a result of the past. How will be my future? Future depends upon what you are doing the present. This is the most important thing. What are we? We are the product of our thoughts. So we will straight away jump into this particular hand image. This is the hand image that we will be referring to. I will be comparing it with the hand of uh, Sachin Tendulkar and Shah Rukh Khan. <coughs> Basically this person uh, had many questions like uh, put in hundreds of questions. Uh, he also sent me a few images with these things pointing out like is mentioning a fish he is mentioning fishes out here two or three fishes i i'm not able to see what uh, what kind of a fish he is looking at then he is looking at ladders and he is looking at fish again out here at this particular portion and uh, particular portion then vishnu sign see i am not aware about these particular signs that people talk about repeatedly and i don't value them i'll just i just show you the hand of uh, sachin tendulkar luckily we have a very very clear kind of a hand image out here and you would see that the hand is extremely simple with least amount of lines you are seeing the least amount of lines the heart line is very very simple indicating detachment this is energy levels stamina it's well padded that means high energy and the person is not wasting his energy this is the area of fire less lines over it basically means person is not wasting his fire a strong mercury line the person has got a skill lesser lines means unlimited possibilities so i'll just close this particular image and show you briefly i'll show you the hand of uh, Shah Rukh khan again there's no ladder, there's no Vishnu, there's no fish, nothing. They, we don't have anything in this. But the hand has got qualities. Lesser lines over the palm means the better it is considered to be. Don't think that having very special signs would give you uh, some special capabilities. It's nothing like that. Person is also mentioning a Damru that you see out here. Uh, he's mentioning like two triangles that are forming this is uh, Damru he is basically saying so let's basically straight away jump into this part of particular palmistry reading I'll if briefly telling you a few things it's not going to be a complete kind of a reading but uh, but whatever I can say in this limited time I will try to explain to the first thing is that the head and the lifeline they both are joined at the initial start this makes a person very cautious shy and hard working so these people get success in the later period of their life uh, success coming to the later period of life doesn't mean that the person is not going to be uh, having good life in the earlier period it's just that the person is slow to act and the person contemplates 100 times before taking a decision this is the lifeline sorry this is the lifeline and there are many upward lines that you see out here pointing towards the either the saturn mount or the jupiter mount saturn mount if they are pointing it means that the person is going to be lucky unlocking of financial resources remember unlocking of financial resources it could be uh, getting from his parents it could be like he making his own money and that work that money basically coming to this particular person's use this is the most important thing because sometimes we have we have huge amount of wealth but we are not able to use that particular wealth at all the other part is that this is the heart line it is straight away curving and reaching the mount of saturn it basically saturn is the mount of wisdom so the person is likely to take wise decisions Saturn is also the area of practicality so the person is likely to have a very practical uh, attitude and that is the reason why more practical decisions are going to come about the person is grounded because Saturn uh, is a slow moving, slow moving planet so it means that the person is extremely grounded 
so it basically means that the person has his ears to the ground and he notes the ground situations what are the likely possibilities what are the possibilities that can really happen because some people they might have their heart line reaching to the mount of jupiter it would make them idealistic and it would make them uh, like very very emotional kind and not not realistic kind so this is basically is not considered to be the best sign to have if if the if the heart line is reaching the mount of jupiter the other part is that the heart line is curving it is curving the heart line is curving uh, towards the mount of saturn it means that the person is highly passionate and temperamental by nature so this is another possibility that can arise and the heart line reaching the mount of saturn means that the person is good at money management it means that wherever there is a possibility to make money the person is likely to make money try to understand this is one big quality people miss out people have their heart line reaching the amount of jupiter they have a possibility to make money but they would be they would become uh, have, grow with high ideals and become very sensitive and they say this is not right this is wrong so that is the reason they are losing out on opportunities a very poor mind can come to them to a person having the heart line reaching the amount of jupiter it would mean that the person is likely to uh, soften his uh, uh, would go very really soft and if the per other person is asking for free consultation the person is likely to give free, free consultation that is the reason why the person is not likely to have good money so try to understand these are the signs that we look at we don't look at i don't look at wish vishnu fish or ladder or fishes whatever these things are there yes but triangle sign is an important sign to have triangles on the on the like money line or on the or on the lifeline are considered to be properties it means the person is likely to make properties so uh so this is the reason why the heart line reaching the amount of saturn means that the person would manage money really well and that is the reason why the person is likely to have good amount of money uh and uh, the person i have already said both these lines are joined together for a long duration uh, life and head so later period of life the person is likely to be successful then we have few perpendicular lines over the mount of mercury so uh, this mount of mercury basically signifies skill so having perpendicular lines over the mount of mercury means the person has got multiple set of skills although uh, these uh, some people might just have a single line even a single line would give excellent result you do not need to have Four, five, six, ten, fifteen, twenty lines to be successful. Just one single line can be can mean extremely successful. Shahrukh Khan does not have even a single line over here, so uh, you don't need to have an, uh, any line. It's just that you do not should not have weak kind of lines. People have got very weak and wavy kind of line. Those are considered to be bad. It would bring in that the person would not be like uh, their skills are. Not going to be sharpened. The more the strength of the line, the more the skills are sharpened. Some people have got crisscrossing lines, so crisscrossing lines would mean that the person would miscommunicate and miscalculate. Having perpendicular lines means the person is going to cal to uh, be good at calculations and uh, good at uh, like uh, the person is good at calculations and good at communication. Then we look at the heart line. This is the heart line again. This, there are few branches downwards these are these meaning that the person is likely that these are falling down on the the base of the palm any line that is leaning downwards from the heart line is considered to be not so good line if if a branch was something like upward like this it would be positive if it, if it is downward it means that disappointments in relationship or dis, or some uh, disappointment in uh or a high expectations from a relationship or a object or anything and that is not getting fulfilled and that is a reason why 
stress is develop, uh, developing in, in such a person and the person is getting distracted, the person is lacking in focus. So it's not so bad. The way I'm describing, you might think that it's, it's extremely bad. It's not so, mu so much, but if, 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 if these lines were extremely strong, 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 then the possibilities of the person totally like going disarray uh, and the po person totally losing the focus increases but having these smaller lines also the person gets distracted so uh, you might have seen in the hand of Shah Rukh Khan and in the hand of Sachin the lines are very distinct and clear it means that there is detachment and detachment does not mean detaching yourself from the wealth you have basically made it doesn't mean that you are detaching yourself from your parents or your your children or your wife or your friends or not enjoying a good car or a good house those things it does not mean leaving all these things and going towards sainthood it basically means being in the moment without having expectation this is the attitude those people have so uh, this is the other negative i would say uh, i am not very sure about this particular line and uh, it could be a good sign it could might not be such a good sign this is the area of mars positive this is the area of coolness and calmness and uh, the line that is leaning downwards probably in his heart this particular aspect might be playing out in his emotions in his uh, in his feelings this particular aspect might be playing out it appears that let's take a look at another hand before we basically Briefly, just by looking at this hand, we look that this area is highly developed, well padded. It means high energy levels. The desires are there. So you need to have desires to be successful. So more the desires, the more likelihood, the more uh, like likelihood of success increases. This is one part. Then you have this. It, it appears that this area also appears to be padded. It means that good organizational skills, good political understanding of things. There are few upward lines also, which means the person would seek honor and the person is likely to get honor the person also mentioned that his thumb is very flexible it's flexible to some to some extent but there are people who have got more flexible uh, thumb flexibility of thumb basically means that the person is likely to be adaptable and uh, uh, the person is able to mold himself to any situations left hand and right hand if they appear to be more similar so it basically means same, same thing if we read the left hand or the right hand it does not matter at all so uh, we just take a look at uh, this particular the finger of mercury appears to be a little bit shorter whenever it is not reaching the ring finger top portion line it means that the person is likely to like the person is likely to miscommunicate with the near and dear ones probably probably with his uh, people who are far away like the person he meets at work, uh, the, the person he meets uh, not so regularly, the person is able, would be able to communicate in a very, very good way. But when it concerns people who are really close by, this is where the problem is going to develop. Probably it might be parents in the earlier period, then it might be brother, sister, then wife, or maybe even children. So those things can arise uh, apart from that the person is also temperamental and uh, I can't say if this area is really developed because it appeared to be extremely well padded in the other hand so that is the reason why I said so uh, now this particular area this is the area of Mars negative and there are there are too many lines over it the person says that the person has got a triangle he's trying to basically find some good sign that might appear out here but take a look there are more lines out here crisscrossing lines so crisscrossing lines basically signify that the person is likely to get angry over wrong issues this is basically the area of fire so the person might misuse his fire and misuse his anger and it is suggested that the person tries to uh, tries to not get angry over wrong issues then we look at the intersection. This is the money line and this is the headline. This is the intersection, age 35. 
So this portion of life we are going to take a look. This is age 35. And at this particular moment, you would notice that there appears to be an island just under the finger of Saturn, so depression. Uh, but there's also an upward line that is pointing towards the Mount of Mercury. Any line pointing towards the Mount of Mercury from the headline or maybe heart line anywhere, it's considered to be good. It means some success. So it is happening before the age of 35, very close to before the age of 35. I can't say about this line, there's a backward line, so backward lines are lawsuits and all before the age of 35, so I am not really sure that if this is the line uh, we are talking about. And out here also, there are too many lines out here. Uh, this is the area of uh, like uh, Mercury, I've already told you, and uh, people who have got many perpendicular lines, they could be extremely good doctors or healers, but, uh, but, uh, uh, but I, I say it in a different way, I just say that if there are more lines, there are multiple set of skills and multiple set of skills basically signify uh, that, that the person is uh, uh, like, uh, they know many, many, many things, but they have not mastered it because these lines are not very distinct and clear on the left hand. Better just to have a single line that is good enough to be successful or you don't even have a one line at all. The headline branching into two makes a person genius, but <clears throat> it doesn't make a person a Einstein. It just means that the person, when it is concerning, like uh, when it is concerning, uh, they're competing with their with their uh, colleagues. These people have that ability to see two sides of the coin at the same time. Then a strong line here is coming and striking the headline. And at this portion also there's an upward line. So a trouble line comes from here and strikes the headline. So somewhere after the age of 35, maybe probably 38 or so. And there's an upward line. So again, some success. So problem and success, both things are there uh, at the same time. Now we look at the Dumbo. He mentions basically the Dumbo. I won't say, uh, I've not read any good book that says anything about the Dumbo. But uh, if this, imagine this is the lifeline. I had mentioned that upward lines are gains. Upward lines basically signify that the person is likely to be uh, lucky in his life. This is the earlier period. And let us imagine there's an offshoot from the lifeline going downward. Then this is a loss. Loss of health or loss of wealth. It could be any one of them. But the upward line like this, and if a triangle is getting made, so a property can be made. Uh, so this is one aspect. Then we look at the other triangle that is appearing on the on the money line. So uh, which the person says that is a dumb rule. Uh, so if this is the thing uh, that we see, it basically signifies that the uh, property possibilities arise. But I, I say that it's better to have a very independent kind of a triangle over the over the uh, over the money line that brings much uh, that that is a better possibility than having this mixed kind of a indication. Uh, just to complete before I complete the lines. Uh, a little bit leaning down but these are okay if they were too much leaning down then it would have been bad like the partner creating stress but out here it's okay this is just a line of attachments the person mentions a vale vale is basically unrealistic fantasies but this is not not so clear so i won't basically uh, say anything about it fish i've already told you i won't say anything because i don't consider it to be a very very important kind of a sign and uh, just take a look at anything important that I might have missed out the other hand image that, that I have got An island out here means elongated periods of emotional stress. Out here also, 
and Ireland sometimes under the ring finger could mean eye related issues or heart related issues but you don't need to be very worried about this because it's not a show shot sign the islands out here so the troubles might have been there uh, for some time and uh, this is appearing in the earlier period so there could have been emotional issues To upward lines appears in these small lines although if they were more distinct it would have been better moving towards jupiter means position power honor then this line suddenly lean in the initial period it, it is straight but suddenly it leans a little bit downwards so imagination somewhere at the age of 32 or so and uh, uh, and it's going above also towards the mercury so it means that the skill part is also developing during that particular period gaining in skills and uh, some benefit coming to the person let's take a look on the right hand as well in this case it does appear that the money line is ending on the on the headline and a new one is developing somewhere at the age of 34 or 35 and two or three lines are developing so two or three different sources of income might develop uh, lastly before ending i would just say look at these lines this is the career line these are career lines so these lines are not not so very deep and clear uh, but it, it, it doesn't mean that you, if you've got a weaker career line, everything is going to be weak. There, there have been many positive signs. Uh, and uh, an island out here, I have already told you, depression before the age of 35 or stomach-related issues. And so a weaker sunline basically signifies that what might happen is that there might be few doubts. And uh, doubts, so whenever they come about in your life, that is basically considered not considered to be good uh, it means that everything is getting clouded and you're unable to find your way out and you're unable to figure out which work to do or and which not to do and you're not giving full energies to your work if if, if the sunline worry was very distinct and clear it would have signified that the person is likely to be uh, uh, like uh, no uh, like the sun whenever it is shining bright it is giving uh, tap and tap, tap to its uh, to earth and that's the reason why more plants are growing it, it is energizing the earth and that's why more plants are growing so if the line was distinct and clear it would mean that the sun is shining bright if the lines are a little bit weak it signifies that at some times the work is going to be good and and other times it's not going to be good because the person is not giving full energies to his work the person is doubting his work so if the person stops doubting things might increase the person also have got a supporting lifeline it signifies fighting spirit so you would see many 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 upper lines so luck is always going to be there with his side he just needs to focus that's it for this particular reading i hope you like this video if you like the video click on the like button and to subscribe to my channel this is you have to click down below just under it and subscribe and press the bell icon thanks for watching bye and take care